Not that I'm a bad shot. <laughs> I'm trying to shoot through the scope of the camera. But if I might do it, you can see what I'm doing. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yo, what's up? Guess what? I got arrested today. Why? Because your country cowboy carries a gun around in Nashville when I go off road. And I didn't realize I had my little gun in my bag when I went through check through. So. A cowboy in Nashville, Tennessee brought a gun to the airport today. Everybody thinks that's an April fool because he looks black. That's whack. Not true. But I get it. I had this big bubble coat on. I had this big cowboy hat. And then they found my gun in here. So when they freaked out, I felt dumb for keeping my gun in my bag. But anyway, they zip tied it. They took my bullets. So I'm going to bust a couple rounds off. Look, hey, how many of y'all thought that I missed when I was shooting and was surprised when I picked up the other one and you seen it leaking? If you thought that I missed and I caught you off guard when that one was leaking, hit that like button. So anyway, so I started a travel vlog. So I travel around the country. I write music about things that inspire me, things that I live, things that I do. And uh, so I started a travel vlog. Most of the time in Nashville, where I grew up at, we can have guns. I was born in Texas as well, so Texas and Nashville, Tennessee. It's guns and hunting. But little old me. You know, COVID happened. I was willing to go hunt to provide for my family like a man. Food though. Food. But anyway, they found this in the airport in my bag. And that's why I wasn't arrested. I guess I was detained. Will it not go off? So sometimes I have issues my, with my little 380 dry firing. It hits the 
bullet, but it won't fire. But all in all, I just figure it'll do a couple if I need it. So anyway, so back to the airport. So I go to the airport and then I didn't realize that I had a gun in my bag from when I go off-roading this stuff. And don't you know that they had this one guy that was, I was like, hey, let me grab that bag right quick. He was like, no, that's your bag. But there's a gun in it and it's loaded. I was like, ooh. <laughs> in that bag? He was like, yeah, in that bag. I was like, well, it's gotta be my 380 if it's a gun in the bag. You don't know if there's a gun in the bag. If you're stopping everybody and saying that there's a gun in the bag, I am pretty sure that there's a gun in the bag. And it would have to be my 380. And there were some people walking around with these things, right? They were just, they had the little strap. So when they called the little code in, man, I was just like, Lord, please have mercy on me. But anyway, uh, I guess I'm supposed to turn that too, huh? But anyway, so if I gave anyone advice today, ladies, if you go hiking, get you a little 380 to keep in the bag. It's a very nice deterrent. Even if a bullet dry fires, you still got a couple of shots off to get you to safety. All right. What I do not recommend is not checking your bags thoroughly before you go to the airport. You may have left a gun in it accidentally if you live some type of country or in the country.